You are very close to the chain over that all of you have been waiting for, Mother Gaia, Sinanda, one who serves and Ashira. Sinanda and one who serves channeled by James McConnell. Mother Gaia and Ashira channeled by Dr. Susan Samarco. Web pages, www.meetup.com, Ancient Awakenings. And, www.ancientawakenings.org. Note. These messages were given during our weekly Sunday Prepare for Change group in Phoenix, Arizona on January 29, 2017. Also note, the question answer session was not transcribed but you can listen to the audio file at our www.ancientawakenings.org website. Just click on audio channelings, and then either hear or download. Mother Gaia. I am Mother Gaia. So glad to be with all of you today. Yes, we knew what kind of a turn this group would take today. We plotted ahead of time to be able to speak with you. We know that we were with you on your advance weekend retreat in early December and we all had many things to share. What I want to share today is this. With all of the experiences you have had around this, that I have moved to the fifth dimension. I am there in security. There is a small part of my energy that I am keeping for those who want to be in that realm. That is not you. You are fourth and fifth dimension. You dip back into the third at times but mostly you are fourth and fifth dimensional beings. All of these things that you have shared today are joint experiences with mass consciousness that are helping to join you with one another to move forward. It is not a question I am ascending. I am ascended. I did that. It is important that each of you shares your experiences, your dreams, all of those things that have been given you in the past and in the present and in the future. Because all of those have meaning. They have a cultural, collective meaning for you. They will continue to lead you on your ascension process. We know this is hard to understand but one of the things that was appropriate at the beginning of this session was the sharing that Sheila gave to you. And you laughed but deep down you knew there was a lot of truth to that. A lot of truth to that. Many of you worry about Fukushima, about lack of rain on the planet. All of these are part of the third dimension. There are things you can work on but as you move into the fifth dimension, you will no longer have to work on those because I am in great shape. I am in great shape. I have plenty of water. I have been giving water to humans all over the planet. Some of those are reported. Some of those are not. There are new minerals that are coming up. There are all kinds of new opportunities that I am creating for my children, for all of you. This is a wonderful time to be alive. Although it is hard to watch some people move through to get where they are going, those of you in this room, on this phone and who read these words know that we are very close to that changeover that all of us have been waiting for. That is my message for today. Brief but one of joy. One of happiness one of love. We give you our thanks for your time. Thank you. Sananda. This is Sananda. Like Mother Gaia I am here for a brief message. This is to prepare you for the next one to come in the meeting where you come together with the Hollow Earth audience. This is an auspicious time you are moving into. I use that word specifically because of all that is about to occur. You have heard these things many times before but understand that at some point all of this will be real. Real at your level. Yours in the fourth and fifth dimension, as Mother Gaia has spoken. And also real to those who are still in the third dimension. All will be revealed. That is my message for today. Just be ready. As for next week when I come with a further message to reveal to you, your missions. What you are here for. You have been wondering about, waiting for this. More is to come now. More for you to understand. More for you to know. Because the time is nigh. All of my peace and love be with you. 
as you continue on moving toward that ending process that you came for a long time ago. Peace and love with all of you. One who serves, greetings to you. One who serves here to assist you in your question and answer time. We always have answers so you must have questions. We may have answers that you were not looking for all this time. As James has said many times, he likes to know where X marks the spot. He wants to know exactly how things are. This is some time we are speaking of this one. Many of you wish for that as well. You wish to have knowing experience. Yes, this is real. It is real time now, it is all occurring. We have told you many, many, many times it is coming, it is here, now and soon, don't forget that word. And you say we know it is coming but when? We want now. What is that commercial we are getting? It is money and we want it now, it is our information and we want it now. Sit back. Get ready. Fasten your seatbelt. All of these things. The show is coming. It is about to start. You hear this and you hear this and you say start the engines already. But they don't start and you sit there and your vehicle does not go. And you wonder and think that you are still waiting for this stupid show to begin. Waiting and nothing occurs. Nothing happens. But what did Archangel Michael say to you last week? He said look at those things which are happening. Don't look for things which are not happening. This is what we are saying to you. To look around yourself, look within yourself. Look at so many changes that have happened within yourself. Don't even look outside of yourself. Look within yourself. You will see amazing things that have developed within you. Listen to your conversation earlier. We did. There are so many things that are happening in dreams, visions, and lions and tigers and bears, oh my. You are having dreams and visions of lions and all kinds of things here. So just sit back and relax. Everything is coming. Everything is going to happen. Sinanda has said he will speak to you very seriously in the next time here about your missions, what you are here for. To finally get things going. Okay? Ashira. I am Ashira. It is always a pleasure to be with you. I look at what has been said this day and the days before this and I say to you, what else can we tell you? We tell you to hold on. To watch as things unfold before you. We know that things happen and you never see them until the very end when you hear a whisper of what has happened. We know that this frustrates you. You believe yourself to be such a mature being. Even these things that have come out or started to come out have set you aside. We hold you in our hearts. We hold you. We love you. We want this to be over for you and for us. We are moving on too. We are excited. We are excited for all of you to really experience what we are talking about. We give you our love and our peace. Namaste. Channeled by James McConnell and Dr. Susan Samarco. Web pages www.meetup.com, Ancient Awakenings, and www.ancientawakenings.org. Article may be reproduced in its entirety if authorship and author's website is clearly stated. Believing a Seeing.